Hello, in this video I will be demonstrating how to transfer a TI-Inspire file or TNS file from your computer to your TI-Inspire handhelds. I will be using the TI-Inspire Premium Teacher software. In the software there's a tab at the top called Content. When I click on the Content tab I see the options for web content. There's Activities Exchange, Math Inspired, and Science Inspired. I currently have Math Inspired selected. I can now go to the filters at the top, changing the subject from All to Math, Topic from All to Geometry, and Category, I'll choose Circles. Now I have the filtered files for geometry of circles. In the bottom right, I see the options for TNS files. Those are the ones that will go on your emulator and on your handheld. And there are handouts for students both in Word and PDF format, as well as teacher notes in a PDF format. So if I were to select the TNS file, and double click it, it will open in the Documents tab for my students to see on my emulator. I could now go page by page demonstrating to the class with this file. If I want the students to have this same file on their calculators, I'll go back to the Content tab and I see the option above where I saw the TNS files and the handouts to save this activity to my computer. I'll click Save to this activity to my computer and I'll save it to my desktop. Now when I go back to the Documents tab and I select the Tools Transfer Tool I can now click the Add to Transfer list and find that TNS file to transfer to the students. So I will click Add to Transfer list. I'll go to my desktop and I find Tangents to a Circle folder. I will open it up and there's my TNS file which I will select. And then when I click Start Transfer it will be transferred to any handhelds that are hardwired to the computer or connected through the docking stations or the TI Inspire Navigator system. When you are done transferring, you can click on Stop Transfer and then Are You Sure? You can click Yes. One thing to note is that you can organize a student's handheld by choosing the Destination folder. So instead of transferring it by today's date, you could always click on the destination folder and change it. So I might want to call this geometry of a circle. Now when I do start transfer, it will go to a folder created on the student's handheld with that title, organizing it for the students.